Jessica Pagula versus Barbara Kuchikova is a second match in the orange group of the WTA Finals of 2024. Both players have to rebound after a tough loss in the first match. Barbara Kuchikova comes into the tournament as the number 13 in the world and gets the benefit of winning Wimbledon and the Grand Slam rule that has been introduced, meaning that if she was in the top 20 by the end of the season, she would get that last spot, the number 8 spot, instead of somebody who actually finished with more points in front of her. So, a little bit fortunate Kuchikova to get in. Her best result here was actually three years ago, where she lost in the round robin stage. She actually lost all her matches there, but the 2021 WTA Finals, if you remember, was really, really stacked, and it was really, really even, so a little bit hard not to get one win there. Her record this year hasn't been great, 19 wins and 14 losses, but she has that Wimbledon title, and that's all that matters when she's coming into this tournament. Her best win was actually at Wimbledon against Rabakina in that semi-final, which really proved that she deserved to win that title. Her worst loss, however, was at the US Open to Rousse, who came through the qualifying and beat Krajikova in a big upset in the second round. Her form lately has not been good, with a lot of losses, but also injury as well, so it was will be interesting to see if Krajikova can come into this tournament healthy enough to compete against the best of the best. Jessica Pagula enters the tournament as the number six in the world and is playing this tournament again, having made the final last year, losing to Sviantec after really, really impressing in the group stage and the semi-finals of that event. Her win-loss record this year is 39 wins and 14 losses. It's pretty impressive considering she didn't play for a lot of the start of the season. Two titles are also included in that, including the 1000 event in Canada, where she went back to back. Her best win is against Igor Sviantec. That was at the US Open only a couple of months ago. Her worst loss though was against Krunic on the grass courts of Den Bosch, where she lost a three set epic. But maybe we can give her a little bit of a pass on that because she hadn't played for a couple of months before that tournament. Her form though, since the US Open final hasn't been great, but of course during that US Open swing, she did play amazing. So it will be really interesting to see how she does against the rest of her group because she does like to play those big plays and she does get up when she plays those big players. These two players have played two times before with the head-to-head -head split down the middle 1-1. However, they haven't played in over 18 months. The last time being in Dubai last year where Krajikova, of course, beat Pagula, but also went on to win the title, beating Sviantec in the final, also beat Sabalenka that week. So Krajikova was having a great week that week. It's been a long time since they've played, but after the first matches, you gotta think Krajikova's a chance. If Krajikova's gonna win this one, she's hopeful that she's healthy because she wasn't great at the end of that Sviantec match. Her back was starting to hurt. She ran out of gas. She was in such a good control as well with a set and double break against the world number two. So she can't let that slip if she does get off to a good start again against Gula. Pagula's gonna win this one. She needs to eliminate the errors because she hit a lot of errors against Goff. Goff played well, but also gave her a lot of free points. So if Pagula does limit the errors and keep it clean, she should be able to get the win. Interesting matchup to have at the WTA Finals. These two have played some good matches in the past, but I have to go with Pagula in this one in three sets. I reckon she rebounds after a very poor first match. And also Krajikova, I don't even know if she's gonna play because of injury because she didn't look great against Fiontek at the end. So I'm gonna go Pagula in three, but let me know in the comments below who's gonna win this one. Win this one.